Yo, what's up guys? It's your boy Nitro Storm here. Welcome back to Revive Witch. So this will be a quick video regarding the latest element summon. So uh, like the previous element summon, which was Mercury, the blue colored element, they have now released, you know, uh, like a few days ago, well yesterday, the saltstone element summon, aka the yellow colored element. And just to make it quick, Essentially, what's inside this banner are non-limited saltstone element dolls that have been released so far from the beginning up until now, excluding very recent banners. But fortunately for saltstone's case, it's literally every character that they've released so far. Because Parfait was the last release, the latest um, Saltstone release, and she is in here. So we have Ella, Tonel, Parfait, Metamorphosis, Flora, Kamui, and Kapla. So Kamui is the character that is currently in the um, Battle Pass. So if you bought the Battle Pass, you'd have Kamui by now. But yeah, is this, you know, for the next part of the video, is this banner worth summoning on? Now, if we go through each of these characters, the notable ones that I would say would um, help benefit your roster. Um, the highest rated one in my opinion would be Tonel. Um, she's basically used uh, basically everywhere still. You know, it's been a while now since the release of this game and Tonel is basically still the most used support in the entire game because she heals and buffs, you know, and she has chaos generation. Uh, I would say next up would be Metamorphosis because she does still provide good support and damage. Um, very good for AoE settings as well. And I think third place would be Kapla. And then the rest, Flora Kamui, Ella and Parfait would be the rest. So the top three would be Tonel, Metamorphosis and Kapla. Now, if you were to summon on this banner just for those three, uh, considering that there are seven um, dolls in total, the percentage rate of getting one of them within a 2% drop rate would be less than 1% to get one of these three. And if you look at a normal rate up summon, it's 1% for the rate up with a total of 2%. In this case, it's still a total of 2%, but it's split between 7 dolls. So in this case, pulling for one of these three equates to a less than 1% chance of getting one of those three. So rate-wise, I wouldn't say it's worth pulling on. However, if you're starting out, uh, then maybe pull a little bit. But since Isabelle's banner is up right now, and let's say you're starting out or you or you haven't pulled Isabel yet, then I would rather pull on this banner as she's currently the, in my opinion, the highest single target physical DPS in the game right now. So that's about it for the video. Let's end it off with a YOLO multi. Now, I wouldn't actually recommend doing the 50% offs for the element summons because the pity only stays within each element summon. So the reason why it's 70 is because I did a discount multi last element summon which had Mercury characters. So um, I would highly recommend not doing this, but I mainly do this just for the sake of the video. So let's see what we get. And as you can see, one of the biggest reasons why is that I got a blue animation, which basically means I didn't get even a gold, an SSR. But, you know, I guess, you know, Cope, we at least got 50 uh, back. Uh, apologies for that. I'm currently on emulator right now. And so the some parts of it might be a bit scuffed. And the reason why I'm doing this is because I have internet problems. And so I can't do my usual setup with recording my phone's screen. In any case, hopefully you guys found this short video quite useful. Um, if not, at least it would confirm your thoughts on the banner itself and whether or not you should pull on it. In any case, it's been your boy Nitro Storm. I'll see you guys in the next stream or video. Peace.